you are the joke and we need you to be the joke no matter what it is we ain't no you can't cook you can let me go down here and get this plastic because y'all thought that i was tripping when i told y'all that jonetta got plastic in his season i'm not talking about the silica that's fda approved i'm talking about the silica that you find in your motherfucking shoe that nigga selling that shit, pushing that shit. oh no and now carlos said he coming for everything now carlos is a sneaky mother sucker now for the people here shout out to it's 500 people here can i get some likes please and thank you how y'all watching me and ain't giving me no likes y'all don't love me can somebody text me text me in and everybody please the number is below the screen please text me i'm lonely one eight five eight five one nine ten zero two text me let me know what you think about this dragon tales are you a victim do you need to call the fda in your local state department to report this nigga for selling silica to you carlos said he want everything first of all you done came out and said you did this shit for 15 years ain't no fucking way in hell I'm going to say I've been in the business for 15 years without without admitting that I'm still reaching my goals and act like you're established when your fucking teeth look like you've been chewing on barbed wire down there, sir. OK, look like you got a super numeral tooth. That means that you was neglected as a child. Your mama couldn't afford it. You've been in the business for 15 years and they fix your teeth, Carlos. No, you's a grifter. Jonetta said, get away from me. Y'all stole my money. And you humiliated them because you couldn't get them into the BET Awards, bitch. And now you got K Diddy. K Diddy, the one that ate that little girl cookie. K Diddy, you ate that little girl cookie. You need to be in jail, K Diddy. K Diddy done picked up the pieces. They falling. HIV, HPV. And they can't get up. Ain't it all. Passing it, doing everything. Now, Carlos' real problem is... You know, and like I told you, I'm an actor. It's my job to understand the human psychology, right? So I, I typically, people call me a creative genius and I'm like, no, I just, I'm just like on a whole nother level psychologically. But this nigga was booking Joe Netta and Charles for all, to all the gay clubs and he was in that bitch partying. Oh, no. He was running away from his wife, didn't want to take care of his pregnant wife. Now, y'all remember when Joe Netta told that nigga, you need to go worry about your pregnant wife instead of being in the gay clubs. Now they got K. Diddy, who looking for the underage little girls that they must sit in the club, okay? K. Diddy, you need to be in jail, K. Diddy. I told you, bitch, you gonna be on the menu, K. Diddy. Mm -hmm. Now, Carlos, when Joe Netta kicked this nigga to the curve, he all of a sudden started managing Peaches DeBrar. Now, no shade, Dr. Michelle. I know you love the DeBars and stuff. Mama DeBars gone. You ain't got to lie for them. Elder, just because you got siblings don't mean you got to I ain't wasting no time. I appreciate mine, but hey, the ones that's here that ain't, I ain't wasting none of my emotion and intelligence, right? This nigga went from Joe Netta to icons, okay? The Beyonce's of the internet. Oh, no. And I, we, we, you can be Beyonce, Joe Netta, but bitch, I'm Rihanna. People go fuck with me regardless. Everything about you is forced. Your face so ugly and we needed to stay ugly. Not you out there trying to look like a temporary handsome squid, but cause them goddamn Sanders and sister bumps gonna come back on your motherfucking face and we know. Oh, no. Now, Carlos, Carlos, we know you're a boxer boy, okay? We know. Me know you said it at the Jamaica, okay? Me cool it, but I'm half Jamaican. Okay, I can still play when I see one. Just like DJ Academics was crying because he didn't want to fight Sasa Santana because he was going to dig off in his ass. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, no. Fuck around and find out the niggas like it. They do, Carlos. You mad because you can't use Jonette and Charles to book them out to do gay clubs so you can go over there in there and get your life together and shit. You missed them opportunities. And now you got a newborn baby with a woman that you don't love. So you want your name attached to Jonetta because, nigga, you ain't nobody. Oh, no. Hello. That I had started to put together that I, because I, I own a book publishing company. So I had started to solely. Um... Mind you, this is the same nigga that reached out and got onto this uh, Hillary Sanchez. Hillary Sanchez, you on content too, motherfucker. Oh. Oh, no. Not you looking like Rick James, bitch. I mean, James Brown with no dance movement. 
The people said you mad and jealous of Joe Netta because you had a Mexican boy who needed a green card and your goddamn ass was so crazy the way he left you before he could even get the green card. Oh, Lord. Say the man had to get away from you. Say you was out there doing rituals and all that diddy shit with that baby oil. And now you mad because Joe Netta didn't trap Charles. And you just like Joe Netta, bitch. Oh no! But we not interested. Joe, we not interested. We we definitely not interested. Hillary Sanchez. We not. Okay, I ain't even gonna lie to you. We not interested. You a little bit funny, but you gotta find some other way. You hating on the bitch because they didn't took over your niche. Put together the uh, the cookbook. Have all the recipes that want that they wanted to go into the cookbook. Uh, but the seasonings was solely my idea. They didn't have any ideas as to what how to move their careers forward now uh, mind you this is the nigga from birmingham hoover alabama and if you look at the picture he looked like he high as fuck nigga why is your pupils that dilated and your ass that glassy niggas ain't photoshopped that that's how you look when you got on camera to tell these lies ah, oh, no. ideas are free for anybody to use we ain't tell you to get up on joe Netta and charles platform and sprinkle that little shit that you fed your wife Shit, you cook you cook worse than Joe Netta, if you ask me. Nigga, see Joe Netta using a pound of bell peppers, onions, banana peppers, half a bag of sugar, that is the brine, and then half a bag of the white, too big. Oh, no. Turmeric, sugar, everything, that's seasoning plastic. And now you want to leech off and connect to these people, bitch. If you own the wedding footage, then you need to release it on the YouTube channel. Shit, everybody want to see that. Release it, make sure it's copyright, put music, do whatever you need to do to own it. Okay? What's going on? I have no clue. No clue. Everybody should be able to type into this live stream. I don't know what. I tell you, you know, we got some stalkers and some hackers. Change the password to your account. That's all I can tell you. I don't know what's going on. And I ain't worried about that shit, okay? Can y'all text me if y'all got any questions, concerns, or anything at 858-519-1002. If y'all text me, text me and let me know if I should open the phone line, same phone number, okay? But not in this particular live stream. But this nigga's high as fuck, bro. Look, this nigga's high as fuck. Dusty as fuck. Um, so, um, so, so, so those were, were my ideas. And, um, so I actually own the intellectual rights to the actual seasonings because it's, you know, through IP intellectual property. So, you know, no, you don't nigga. This, this y'all be like, Oh, did not, don't nobody want to interview with you. Cause bitch, we going to get to the point. We going to get to the facts. Nigga, do you, I had to battle a corporation for copyright law. You don't have no IP. I had all the facts on my side and them bitches tied me up with legal jargon. You don't have no IP, sir. You can't just own these people. I'm just letting the, the seasonings do what they do. You know, I want them to sell because the more that the yeah, seasonings he's slow sell, as fuck. the more that I could, you know, ask for. To a, nigga, a, you better shut up. Nigga, Charles said he gonna beat your ass whenever he see you when he punched the hole through that aluminum foil shade. A court of legal action. Um, so... So, so yeah, and then the seasonings are not the actual seasonings that um, that we had manufactured in a in a in a with an actual blending company whose ingredients are. So, how can you say you own the IP? They did She Joe Netta didn't even take the same ingredients, the quantities through the company. Joe Netta decided to drop ship it. You don't own that shit, and ain't nobody buying um, that shit. I don't know who's making the seasonings or any of that. Um, I just know it's not the same route chasing. in which we were going when uh, when I initially came up with the idea of the seasonings and began to work on them. So, and, and, and correct me if I'm wrong, Mr. Carlos, you actually was working yeah. with actual yeah. manufacturers creating the seasonings. Like y'all was putting it together from scratch. You were <laughs> doing taste testings and getting product the product sampling and all of that am i correct yeah yeah that is correct um yeah yeah that is correct there were there were going to be um three different seasonings um 
and uh, you know, based upon the ingredients that that the, the, those individuals nigga that ain't got shit to do with you. Seasonings. Um, so we, you know, worked the seasonings, reworked the seasonings because it didn't have something in it that was supposed to be in it, um, and all that kind of stuff. But I don't think nah, that bro, this you is the route that that they went. You know, especially not the company that we were uh, initially. Hey, it's five hundred people you know, here. Can I get a thousand with? likes, please? Right. Replay game, and help so me out, please. Thousand if, likes. If I'm not mistaken, describe like and, and you correct me if I'm wrong. When 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 you if you were representing the Miss Hillary Sanchez show and I had came to you as my manager and I said, Hey, hey uh Carlos is the one that actually he admitted talking about he owns a process serving company. That nigga don't own shit. That nigga's a grifter. He the one who made sure uh, that fucking bullshit ass defamation lawsuit that Hillary filed against Jonetta was actually served. Carlos, um, I'm 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 booked to do this show, but it's not in my budget. I don't have it in the budget to do go there and do this or do that. Can you try to get it promo for me or whatever? So. As my manager, you got to go and try to advocate to get these services and tell them, hey, we're going to exchange this for a promo. And if I'm communicating with you, even though you may not know what's in my bank account, but you definitely would know if you had the coins to do what you needed to do. And I based that on what you said earlier when you said they didn't want to have the lawyers that you put together to make to set the funds aside to make the monthly payment for the legal representation. Because I'm assuming you would have had lawyers that would no. work on a contingency basis. Yeah, right? no. Yeah, so I I, I, I work in politics. To, I right. have like hundreds of attorneys in my in my contacts that I work with. Um, so no, you don't, that, nigga. That no, you don't, nigga. You don't work with none of the people. And I don't believe you got hundreds. You just want somebody to believe you somebody. You represent Peaches the Bar, bitch. You represent a crackhead who went to a school function the same, and the, and the kid walked out, and the teacher told him to sit down. He said, fuck you. He don't want to hear that shit. A white kid at that said that. We seen a needle marks on Peaches' arm when she went to that school. Can't hit no note. Can't even teach a music class. Don't even know the basics. Can't read, write, no music. Sing, no music. Nigga, get the fuck up out of here. With attorneys I speak to on an almost daily basis um, about different things that we're working on together. So I have clients who are, you know, who are always willing to work with them. I even, but in this case, you know, entertainment attorney. So we, you know, I had, a, had two conversations with an entertainment attorney. Um, I think out of L.A., <laughs> Um, and these but attorneys like to do things on, on a, um, a retainer, right? So because you put up a certain dollar amount and you have what's called billable hours. So when it, when an attorney is working on something, then, you know, their rate, let's say if the rate is $200, right? And, um, but yeah, and they, they have you on a $1,000 monthly retainer. That means they'll do five hours worth of work for you every month up to that thousand dollars right and then anything else after that is still billable so if they do 10 hours of work for you and your retainer's a thousand then that just means you owe another thousand for the month because it's billable hours so um so so that's that's how that works um and you know but when i you know came back there was an attorney wanted to do eight thousand dollars a month they didn't want to do that came back said okay five thousand dollars a month they didn't want to do that so um, you know, it just so I just left it at, at what it was, um, because they're you know, obviously they weren't serious about having legal representation. And and I, I don't and, and and I know I know that you you try to communicate with him and you've been on public record saying this man would listen. He wouldn't listen. You you was warning him about things and image and what you do and what you did, but it was all about the for me when it came down in my opinion is fast and easy money fast and easy this it, every it was everybody else's fault but his own and i, I am so proud of the businessman you are and 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 the approach you've taken a lot of people don't realize the oh damages, my gosh your damages will go up based on they sell so when you go in to sue and do the things you do they gonna calculate everything that joe diddy made and and, and it's gonna get transferred all over to you 
just because you got so many years to act on your 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 claim against Joe Diddy. Yeah, you know, um, Jay Z has a quote that says, "I'm not a businessman. I'm a businessman. I am a business." And so, you know, I've been in business for uh, more than ah, ten years. Um, doing various things. I'm bro, this I cannot listen to this nigga, bro. I cannot. Li- I know y'all want to listen to it, but I I cannot listen to these niggas. I can't. He sound like bitter. He bitter, like I told you. Carlos mad because he don't have that outlet. He want to take, he was living his best life going to them gay clubs, pretending that it was all about Joe Dad and Charles. He's sipping daiquiris and shit, talking to, man, get out of here, Carlos. Institutions. Um, Let me go get so this season. I have a lot of knowledge about how a lot of this stuff works. Um, I've been in entertainment for about 15 years, worked with almost every celebrity you can think of, and have worked closely with their teams, worked closely with their attorneys. So I've seen a lot of this stuff. I've seen people be like ripped off completely, high name celebrities be completely ripped off because they didn't have legal representation, didn't know how to do things, and so people get sued before. So I've seen some of everything you can, you can possibly imagine. Um, so, so yeah, um, you know, you can, oh, you can lead a horse to the water, to the fountain, but you can't make him drink the water. And, 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 and you, you are so right. And, and we, we all know, we all know, um, what we deal with. And let me recap you, because you probably didn't know this. So Joe Diddy had taken some information from people on this app and went on his popular platform from defaming me, slandering me, and lying and, and went to stay for last and he was on a Sunday. You give me a lot of information. I can't remember all this. Well, all the time. And then in your professional opinion, when when things would come up and you would explain things to him, did you find yourself having to repeatedly repeat yourself yeah, multiple every, yes. times? Multiple times. All the time. All the time. And then act as if they don't know what I'm talking about. Then it's like, oh, you give me a lot of information. I can't remember all this. Well, you know, you are a grown individual, forty some years old. You know, you either slow, just flat out slow, or you you know, you you can you have a comprehension problem. Or, or it's, it's, it's something, you know, I mean, there, there's only so many times I can tell you something. You tell me something, I'm 31. You tell me something one time, I will remember forever. I just hired, I'm in Phoenix right now. I've hired yeah, like, 200 people in the past month. Nigga, shut up. And, and, shut um, the hell up, nigga. We like when I you were losing your mind. Their names, the first time I saw their name. Nah, let, let me so, show you what we like about you, nigga. Like, I, I'm going to take this detour. That's what I'm saying, nigga. Nigga, if you want to be talked about, you want to be all that shit, nigga. Then you gonna have to be the. Cl- Listen, we gonna get on this fucking seasoning right here, clucking chicken blend by Joe Netta and Charles. Okay, I'm standing by my initial review. You can't even shake this shit up when you do. It's like shit is fucking crazy, yo. Uh, let me go to live streams. Okay, it was a live stream. We 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 already seen what the niggas was on. Like we, I want to remind y'all, like what these niggas is really about. All this other shit that you talking about doing, nigga. Nigga, this is what we talking about. I'm gonna play a little snippet here. Shit, this is why I hate using um Streamyard. It's too slow for me. Yeah, it's, it's it don't even say. Yeah. I, it don't say it unless you did it a while back ago. Yeah, you might probably keep getting on and off. <laughs> it won't. It don't give me an option. No. Okay, let me see what he gonna do. He he, he want to come in alive. Oh, he on the line. He on the line. He, he, he want to be on this line. No, here you go. He don't want his fans to know that he's really a liar. You're really, no, really a scammer. You're really a scammer. You're really a scammer. And it's really sad and pathetic because I actually consider you to be a friend. And I was sitting here telling tell, you. Tell us how you were scammed. No, nigga, babe. Tell us how you agreed to work with me. Tell us how you were scammed. That's what I want to hear. I'm going to let you think after I talk because you blocked me. So I can't talk in your lives. So I'm going to let you think after I get my words out because. When in February, you brought up Richie from February. Yes, I never denied Richie. I'm not ashamed to say I reached out to her. I wanted to no, I'm trying to figure out. 
Bro, get to where I stand. Get to where I stand. You trying to lie. Okay, we we already cleared that up. No, get to where I stand. You get to where I stand. You. So we're gonna get to where you're standing. So like I said at the beginning, our name is Miss Miss Ed I had just her to get her lashes done here by one of the best lash techs here in LA. And we were both of her up. Last minute I kept on messaging, emailing back and forth to the assistant, no reply, no reply, then a day after where I scam you. Get to where I'm a scammer. Right. They're not available no more. Shut up, Carlo. You said get to the scamming part, so shut the fuck up and let me talk about it. So at the end of the day, you said, okay, like Hey, you gotta look at my closet, my phone gonna die too. Hey, what's up, Simply? Let, let's I'm listen to this. You there, sweetheart? Get it off behind. Okay. Yeah. I can hear you. Okay. I said, you said we fired her. Uh, she actually tried to message me and say that you were the one to cancel, but she's unprofessional. We let her go, blah, 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 blah. You said, but I'll keep you in mind the next time. The next time I come around, what did I do? I delivered. I did her hear like I said I would. You messaged me and said that her hair was already yes, written down. You said that she already had wigs, and you said that someone, that Duke had hired somebody to come in and style the hair. So why the hell would I bring my wig there for someone else to sit here and style when she already got wigs? Okay, I'm, I'm trying to get to where I scam you. Don't make me out to be a liar because you lied to me. Where, where, where did I scam you? Where the wig at? Where the wig at? Okay, oh, come on. We're going to take this. I'm no, going to take the, you, you take the live you on You call me. I'm still trying to figure out where the scam at. We're going to take the live on the floor again. Where I was to have live, we got to I said, you know what? I just hair so bomb. I'm done. 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 I'm Okay. So we went because you. What happened to the money? Just say that. And let him let him speak. What are you talking look, about, nigga? That's look, what I'm fucking speak. addressing. Answer the seventy five hundred. Look, look, shut the fuck up. I'm asking you. What's up? What? That's the goddamn question. Shut the fuck up. I'm asking. Nah, you got the fuck up. Got our money without a broken. That's the goddamn question. How about that? Ooh. He's lying. Not Charles. Look at his face. What's up, William? Liar all on him. Look at his face. 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 Look at his Anybody, are y'all gonna be quiet so I can fucking speak? No, it's no, you don't run this line. You come over here telling people to shut up and listen to you. Okay, so I'm just gonna speak. I don't give a fuck if you speak or not. You speak so whatever the fuck the, you want so to. First, so the first, so there was two payments sent over. Five thousand okay? dollars each. The, the first payment, twenty five hundred. Uh, I got. We, you got twenty five hundred. There was some things that had to be paid for. I got to go back and look and see oh. what we paid for. But some things got paid for, and I sent you the rest of the money. Oh, All right? you so sent me twenty five hundred dollars. You ain't sent me no rest of nothing. The Okay, I'm speaking. You won't let me finish. Well, yes, the no, fuck I am. You said you sent me the rest of the money. What money? The rest of the money you sent me. The rest of the money from the first five thousand dollars. I got that twenty five hundred dollars. Okay. I told you I got that. So Where from the seventy five. The other five. We and we had our. What do you? Is it was ten thousand dollars. Man, hold on, baby. Hold on. Uh, yeah, you, where's you the seventy five hundred? Where's the what Charles on here, man? That's what I want to know. Where's the seventy five hundred? <laughs> Five thousand, five thousand is ten. We know that. The first five. Uh, so you would not, you would not let me fucking speak. You wouldn't let me fucking speak. Seventy five hundred. What's I mean with you, William? But you're here. Let's know. No. I just sat up here and said, "Where's the seventy five hundred? Where's that at?" So I can fucking explain. You slow motherfucker. You ain't explain shit. I just sat up here. We can explain. So we won't look crazy. Just be quiet. Let let me explain. Where's the seventy five hundred? So the first five thousand. Where's the seventy five hundred? 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 Where's the I don't remember what we had to pay for. Oh, so shit, I have to go. I have to go back and look. Okay, I'm gonna mute you okay, simply. So you will not let me explain. I just you will not let to. me explain. You said you don't know where. Don't get it. I have. I have not finished what I'm trying to say. I have not finished what the fuck I'm trying to say. Please let me fucking finish because you're not gonna sit up here and lie on me. We've had several conversations. The first five thousand that was sent, we paid for something. I sent you the rest of the money, which was twenty five hundred. Mm -hmm. The second five thousand, we like we paid a thousand dollars. We paid for something, and then the rest of the money, the thirty, it was like thirty, thirty five hundred something, went toward paying for the seasoning. But the conversation that we had, the conversation that we had, I told you, you was like, do we have enough for the seasoning? Okay, and I said, I, I said, I said no. So you, you're not being truthful to the people. Oh my I said, god! I know, you, you, I'm, still the the I'm still speaking. I'm still, I'm still speaking. I'll be out in August. You told me you used the money for the season, and you said your seasons would be out in August, Miss Netta. I was right there when you said you that. You would not let me finish. Now, I ain't gonna let you finish. 
the rest of the thir- the, the 3500 went to pay for the season. You said, do we? I said, the see, I said, I said, I called you, I gave you the calls for two of them. You said, do we have enough money? You asked me, do we have enough? Uh-huh. I said, no, I will take care of the rest of it. Okay, so that we can make sure that the third season come out. Okay, so that means I put money into what, the season for the third. For the, what season is that? Is this August? No, that's, I, that's, that's I don't even believe you did nothing. Okay, I don't have people that investigate the place that you were sending messages and stuff for stuff for the season, and there's no seasons that've been purchased, baby. Okay, that is that is that is not true. That is not true. That okay, but you said it's not true. That is where, not is my, true. where is my where is my where is my uh, reality TV show? That's not yours. It's yeah, his. If I'm not, so let me explain that. That's his show. So y'all don't understand business. You're just a you know, don't like part, part, you are not let me speak. This is what you're going to get taken. This is what you're going to get taken. So this is like Parsha Williams is on Real Housewives. He don't own the rights to what he's on on the show. That's okay? a fact. My network own the rights of what we feel for you are. That's a fact. You don't own the rights to it. Who's your network? Network that, that helped you to get the, uh, the payment. The network that helped you get on 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 the stay room. Hell yeah. What was the network name? I'm not gonna go back oh, and forth about this. Well, I'm trying to figure out how, Lord, like, what, what, see, see, how? The people get to see I've been dealing with two slow ass motherfuckers. <laughs> we've been okay. dealing with a dumb ass thief. And don't even can't even get his words together. That's what I keep saying. Us There's slow no opportunity to disagree. This is crazy. I got money. I bet we know that. What I was going ass. All right. I'm talking about what 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 Hey Carlos, this, this is what I want to say to you, okay? And this, this this is what I want to say to you. And this is coming TV. This is coming from the bottom of my heart. That's what I want to know. Where is Carlos? You know we had several conversations between you and I about our trust issues, about our relationship that we had grown towards each other, what I, what I did for you, because you didn't ever have a conversation with me. And I just felt like everything that had happened that you were would, telling me... She would have went this hard at LaQuanda and them other folks. Period. Period. I, was, I went hard like a well, motherfucker. You, I was yesterday. Yeah, you no, you're apologizing. Social media yesterday. Did, did that apologize, Cicely? Hillary, everything. She, she did apologize. I don't think that is a problem. I'm on that I think you can be playing on that attack. I really did. I had for it. I trusted you. I didn't look up to you because you was younger than I was, but I looked at, up to you as being in the industry because you act like that you knew a whole bunch of stuff about this industry. And by me and Charlie, I've been first started working office. in this industry for 15 years. I posted the people that I've worked with. I posted every single person I've ever worked with in my fucking life. All right. This is the first time I've ever worked with some fucking influencers. All right. The celebrities I work with. And she making it bad for they influencers. Like real money. Okay. So they, don't let us make it bad. Who have you worked with? This is where the niggas start capping. That nigga ain't work with nobody, bro. The nigga, the, I mean, here's the thing. If he did work with people, he's not the plug. He can't put people on. That's different than you being a stylist or doing this. You ain't putting nobody on. You don't have that type of clout, that type of reputation. Nigga, you ain't never have access to the breakdown system, which you need in order to fucking hire talent to compete in Hollywood. You ain't never have access to that. See, this is why Carlos don't want to talk to me because... That's what I would ask him. Yo, where's your access to the breakdowns? What is the breakdown? What is that? Uh, this is how I do videos. I just do the little, little, little nigga. Then you, you supposed to have talent that know what to do. You ain't no talent agent, no talent manager. None of that shit. 